There are multiple ways to reclassify a raster in QGIS. All you have to do is just look for reclassification and you can see all the options that come up. For example, you have a reclassify by table, a reclassify by layer. In your built-in QGIS functions, there's also the geostatistical um, analysis enhancement of Saga, where you can also do reclassify values um, in the same manner using a table or ranges, using various input methods. So if you want to reclassify by a table, you have to specify which particular layer you'll be working with, for example an IDW an elevation layer. You'll also have to specify which band you're working in. In this case, there's only one band, it's a grayscale raster, so you won't have an option here. You can then specify the reclassification table. You can add rows, for example, let's say I want to have four classes ranging from 900 to the highest value in this raster is 1799, so be the 1800. So let's say I have 300 um, meters elevation change, so 1200, give it a value of 1, 1200 to 1500, value of 2, 1,500 to 1,800, the value of 3, and then 1,800 to 2,100 will give a value of 4. These will be your reclassification ranges. So it's a fixed table. You can give it a output no data values. In this case, the default is a negative 9,999. You can also say how the ranges will be evaluated. The default is that the minimum value going to including and equal to the maximum value and then of course the output type as well. This is how it's actually going to be stored in your raster, your output raster and then you run it. And you'll see once you're done using these classes you will see the reclassified raster and here it is. So it's been reclassified. In this case you don't actually have a 4 because the input raster, which ended at the 1798.88, didn't actually have that last class of 1800 to 2100. So the output is actually just a single raster with three classes. There's another way that you can interp um, to reclassify raster. You can use Saga. For example, if you do reclassified values, you just give, the, give it the input um, raster. You can say how you're going to do it. For example, you can have ranges here, the methods, or a simple table, or single. And then you specify the lookup table, basically. So I'm going to be doing a range. I'm going to be using the same algorithm that before, minimum less equal to the max. This was that one from the previous example. And then, of course, I can have a var uh, a table lookup table as well, so it was 900 to 1200 was value 1, 1200 to 1500 was value 2, and 15 to 18 was 3, we don't need that last one. And then you simply run it and you will have the same output as before. Yes, and there's a reclassified raster. Done.